Hey everybody, welcome to the Scott Show, the lower divisions of the NCAA show. We talk about um, all the lower divisions, uh, Division 3-2 and the football championship subdivision. We're going to be changing things around a little bit. I'm going to actually cover some of the uh, basketball and hockey in uh, Division 3 hockey and Division 2 and 3 basketball uh, coming up here very soon. Um, I, I had a lot of fun going through all the football stuff. I'm going to jump into the uh, basketball stuff because football's done. So we're not done with the NCAA lower divisions. We're just done almost with the football games. And the reason I say that is because next week is championship week uh, for the Division Three and Division II. Uh, so before we go any further, I want to give a big-time shout-out uh, to Concordia St. Paul. As they won the Division Two Volleyball National Championship uh, over the weekend in Florida. So, big time shout out to those folks. Concordia St. Paul Volleyball Team. As they took the, the win over Florida Southern. So, check that out. And UMD, that's the game they lost. was against Concordia St. Paul and they end up being national champions. So, go figure. I think that the NCAA should change their rules a little bit and have the top two teams in each division move on. Uh, but, you know, when you get to the playoffs, folks, it's just what the playoffs are. Uh, I just think that uh, the Super Regions, I, I think, sometimes are a detriment because you're not getting the uh, national exposure that would be really nice. Uh, so UMD didn't play Florida Southern. They didn't play... Uh, Charleston, or you know, where, wherever else. They played the same teams in their region, and uh, that just shouldn't happen. And I like the fact that football changes it up a little bit. Um, I was talking uh, to a great friend of the show, Liz, um, and we were talking about uh, New Hampshire and South Dakota State. Uh, New Hampshire, of course, in Concord, and South Dakota State in Brookings, and New Hampshire had to go to South Dakota State and play the game, uh, travel all across the country uh, to play this game. Same thing with James Madison and Weber State. Um, and, you know, both teams that traveled lost. So we'll get into that in a little bit. Uh, first of all, I want to announce the two teams that are going to be in the Division Three Championship in Salem, Virginia. It is going to be Mary Harden, Baylor, the Crusaders, against Mount Union. Now, these teams have been 1-2 and two pretty much all season long. Mary Harden, Baylor, has been number one, riding the wave. And they are win, 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 win. And really super excited. Division three football season is coming to an end at the Stag Bowl in Virginia. Salem, Virginia is going to be amazing. So, big time shout out to those folks, Mary Harden, Baylor, and Mount Union uh, Stag Bowl Championship in Virginia. So, that's the Division Two game. Both teams undefeated. Both teams doing amazing work. I mean, they, they've been just going nonstop, full board, wall to wall, making it happen. Now, we move on to Division Two, where it's a little bit different. A little bit different in Division Two, and here's why: because you have Texas A&M Commerce, who defeated number one ranked Central Washington in their region, and then defeated Mankato in their region to get to the semifinals against West Florida, eleven and three, and started out number six in their region, and made it all the way to the finals, beating West. Georgia and West Alabama to get to the semifinals and make it happen. So we have West Florida 11 and 3, Texas A&M Commerce 13 and 1. They will be facing off in Kansas City, Kansas in the Division 2 football championship. And finally, we have our football championship subdivision. We have our games as I said two of them already. We have Weber State versus James Madison, James Madison wins by three points. And then we have South Dakota State manhandling New Hampshire. So the main event game 
For next week is going to be South Dakota State and James Madison. And in the other semifinal, it's going to be North Dakota State University against Sam Houston State. So either you could have James Madison and uh, North Dakota State phase off, and that's the battle of the semifinals from last year where James Madison won. You could have South Dakota against North Dakota State. Uh, those two state teams playing off, they already did. South Dakota State won. Or you could have Sam Houston State, surprise everybody, win and go on to the championship game. We will have all that details next week where we announce the winners of Division 3, 2, and give you guys the championship game for the football championship subdivision, which should be played on the 23rd of December. I'm not even sure when that game's being played right now, but we will get that info for you and come back here on the Scott Show, make it happen. We do that all the time. We make it happen for you guys. We do it up. And uh, just amazing stuff going on. I'm really excited about how we can do this for you guys. Um, and bring you guys the lower division show of the NCAA. Like I said, we're starting hockey and basketball next week. Here on the Scott Show Podcast. So check us out at tinyurl.com slash 102550. You can get all the podcasts you want. Check us out, and we'll see you guys very, very soon.